multiplication. What if kapag may multiplication? Okay? Edi, simple lang. No? Uh, kapag multiplication, all you have to do is what? Just multiply. Multi um, numerator to numerator, denominator to denominator. Okay? 2 times 5, that is 10. Over 3 times 12, that is... 3 times 12, that is 36. Minsan, nagpapaano pa simply, eh, wala dito sa choices. Wala sa choices. Eh, simplify. Okay? Simplify. Ano yung, ano, an, ano yung pang simplify natin dito? What's the greatest common factor between 10 and 36? That is 2, right? So, this is 5 over, 5 over, Five over thirteen. Okay. Five over thirteen. Mm -hmm. Thir Thirty-six divided by common factor. Common factor. Thirty-six divided by two. One, sir. Okay. Very good. It's eighteen. It's eighteen. Yeah. Kung anong pinan-divide mo, kung anong pinan-divide mo sa taas, hindi pa divide mo sa baba. No? Greatest common for that that's 2. So 10 divided by 2. So 10 divided by 2. Oh, so that's 5, right? Kasi divided by 2. So 30 divided by 2, that's 18. Ayan. Hindi, hindi 13. Ha? Hindi 13. Okay. Okay. Now. Okay. Um... Paano kung ma-avoid yung ganitong proseso? Yung complicated na yung complicated na proseso pagdating sa dulo. O edi, edi i-simplify na natin dun sa bago pa lang tayo mag-multiply. Okay? Pwede naman tayo mag-divide. Dito na tayo. So, look for, look for numbers na pwedeng mag-divide. Basta taas at saka baba lang ha? Hindi, hindi parehong horizontal. Pwedeng slant, pwedeng vertical. Okay? What are the two numbers? So, pwede natin ipan-divide. Yes, that's ito at saka ito, right? They're both even. And they're both even. The common factor between 2 and 12 is 2. Right? So, 2 divided by 2, that's 1. Yes. So, 12 divided by 2, that is 6. Ayun. And then, they just multiply the remaining numbers. 1 times 5. That's 5. Over 3 times 6, that is 18. Still, oh, sorry, 18. So still, I get the same answer. Get it? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh oh So, mas madali na yung mag-simplify ka dun sa una kaysa dun sa, sa bandang duhuli. Uh, for me, ha? For me. For me. Okay. okay. What about this one? Paano kapag whole number? Paano kapag whole number yung isa? Okay, whole number must be um, considered as numerator. Okay, con co can, must be considered as numerator. O, dilagyan mo siya ng 1. Ayan. Para may pantay. <laughs> yung iba kasi nilalagyan niya na ng, ng over 1. Para at least alam nila na ito yung numerator. Okay, di i-multiply mo siya saan? I-multiply mo siya dun sa numerator dun sa kabila. Okay? Eh, masyadong malaki. 14 times kaya ayoko na. Okay. So just ano, just just cancel. Oh, mag cancellation process ka na dun sa sa umpisa pa lang. Okay? What are the what are those two numbers? That's 14 and 8, right? 14 and 8 divided by 2, right? So 14 divided by 2 is 7. 8 divided by 2 is 4. And then you just multiply. Okay? So that's 7 times 3, that's 21. Okay? Over 1 times 4 is 4. Ayan, 21 over 4. That's great. Okay. Ayan. Eh, sir, paano kapag... Ayan na. Paano kapag mixed number na? You multiply 3 times 2 and then 1, 8 times 2, 5, no? Okay. Kapag ganyan, uh, change to mixed number. Okay, change to mixed number. What's mixed number? Okay, or uh, mixed number. Mixed number na pala siya. So, change to improper fraction. Pag sinabi improper fraction, mas malaki yung numerator sa denominator. Okay, what do we do? Okay, ang gagawin lang natin, okay, is to um, multiply 
the denominator by the whole number and then add the numerator. Ganun lang. So that is 8 times 3 plus 1. That's 25 over 8. Very good. And then multiplied by um, 5 times 2 is 10 plus 2 is 12. 12 over 5. Ayan. And then after which, ganyan nating Ayan. Pwede mag-cancel out. No? 25 divided by 5. Co ano? 5. No? Yes. Okay. Itong 12 at saka 8 common factor is 4. Right? So, this is 2. This is 3. Right? So, this will be 5 times 3 is 15 over 2. Sir, sample naman ng fraction na number series. Ah, no, no. Oh, sige, no problem with that. Uh -oh. Sige, tapusin lang muna natin itong ano. Tapusin na muna natin ito. Division. Okay. Division. <laughs> division. Paano kapag division? Um, 2 fifth divided by 3 fourth. That's 2 fifth divided by 3 fourth. Okay, flip the divisor. Pag sinabing divisor, that's the number after the, the, the division sign. So kapag sinabing flip, babalik ta rin. So that's 2 fifth. Tapos yung 3 fourth magiging third. And then, go to multiplication. Okay? So, meron bang, meron bang, meron bang pwede i-cancel out? Taas pa ba? Wala. I think. No? So, wala. If, if that would be the case, then you can, you can do the normal multiplication. So, 2 times 4 is 8 over 5 times 3 is 15. Ayan. Great. What about this one? No? So, flip the divisor, then proceed to multiplication. So, that's 8 over 3. Yung 2 thirds magiging 3 over 2. And then, you multiply. No? So, meron ba? Yes, meron. Mm -mm. 3 and 3. Okay? So, both are becomes 1. And then, 8 di and 4. 8 divided by 2, that's 4. So, mangyayari dyan... Um, that's 4 times 1, that's 4 over 1, or simply 4. Okay. Another tip. Kasi yun ang tip. <laughs> okay. I'll give you a tip. You can do straight device. Uh, you can do straight division. Kung kaya, ng, <laughs> kung kaya ng multiplication, bakit hindi ang division? Diba? Magtatampo ang division sa inyo. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's do this way. 8 divided by 2. That's 4, right? 3 divided by 3, 1. What's 4 over 1? 4. Okay. Yeah. You can do straight division if possible. If possible. Actually, if possible, in a, in a sense na, in a sense na ano, na kung mapapadali ang buhay natin sa straight division, do. Do it. No? Kung malilito kayo, then, then, ano, um, use the the old version. Walang 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 problema don. Okay, you can do straight division. 